Hi, first grade. I hope you enjoyed learning about poisonous plants last week. I was really impressed and excited to read your posters. I thought you did an excellent job with given the facts and information we read and you read. I really loved your illustrations. They had lots of details and um, your warning posters did an excellent job of telling me why I should stay away from plants, what parts of them were poisonous um, and how toxic or how poisonous they were. Um, so thank you for doing a great job on those posters. I'm really proud of you. This week, we are going to start talking more about plant parts. And with that, I have some new literature, some new books um, about plant roots, stems, and leaves. This one has some information about roots and how the roots soak up that water from the ground. I have a book about leaves and stems and how those parts of the plant help the plant live, how flowers grow. And we're also going to continue working on our opinion writing um, with weird and wacky plants and plants that eat animals. So I thought that was really interesting that um, we know a little bit about these types of plants already and we can use that background knowledge as well as new information from the text or from the photographs and illustrations um, to help us compare and contrast and see which book gives more information about plants, which book you liked better. So we'll do a little bit about that in our opinion writing. I also have some really exciting plants to show you and um, we're gonna look closely at them and do our research not only through books but also looking at physical plants. So make sure to get outside this week if you can, um, look at nature and see how plants are growing in your backyard or in the sidewalk, um, wherever you are. Look outside, they're all around. And this is a great opportunity and a time to look outside for the different parts of a plant. Um, so keep up the great work and let's get started.